<laughs> yes, I'm excited to show you something awesome, guys. Bam! That is the brand new Snapdragon 8 chipset. And you know what's next? We go to game. Let's check it out. Hey guys, Thunder E here. Uh, I'm on Kona, Big Island in Hawaii at Tech Summit, and I'm partnered with Qualcomm to give you your first gaming look at the Snapdragon 8 chipset. And honestly, it's gonna be a fun ride for us gamers, right? So we know this chipset is a 490mm chip. Uh, we know it's got some great camera capabilities, but we care about gaming. So let's take, let's take a look at some of the things that actually is gonna impress us as gamers. Now, the Adreno GPU has some great performance increases this year with a 30% performance boost and a 25% power saving, which means uh, as you game, you're gonna get better graphical capabilities and you're gonna be using a less power, which is all we want. Now, the Adreno GPU has actually had uh, a ton of new improvements this year. We have the Adreno Frame Engine, which has more frames to stabilize your games, as well as also improve on that power saving we mentioned. So again, as gamers, you are going to take advantage of some great stuff. Now, I got to play Diablo uh, Immortal. The game looks great, it plays well. It's not out yet, so it's something that you can actually see right now. And some of the things that, uh, you know, games like this would take advantage of, of course, are things like VRS Pro. We saw VRS last year, and VRS Pro is gonna add so much more to your gaming experience, making it for better fidelity. We're gonna have, of course, things like uh, smooth gaming uh, with support for 144 hertz, which we know we love. Faster refresh rates on displays makes gaming just so much easier for people like me and guys like you out there. Uh, we know, of course, there's support for HDR gaming. Uh, there's also volumetric rendering, which means there's so much you can do. Now, the Adreno panel, uh, control panel, is something that's been added this year to give you just better uh, functionality for the GPU and better customization altogether. Now, when it comes to the gameplay experience, like I got my hands on a reference design, which means this is a phone that's built with a brand new chipset and playing on it felt really smooth and really good. You can see how well Diablo Immortal looks. Now, when it comes to uh, audio, we've got Snapdragon sound built into it, which means you've got lossless audio in there. You're gonna hear those footsteps with a game like Diablo, whether you're playing shooters or FPSs, you're gonna hear the gunshots and all that stuff, really nice and crisp and clear. It's built into uh, you know the chipset itself. So you're gonna get all that, as well as also better connectivity with Wi-Fi 6E. So, when you're gaming, if you're using a cloud service like Xbox Game Pass, you're gonna get the best uh, connection you know, to that server, which means games like Minecraft will play well. It doesn't, you don't lose any kind of, kind of uh, connection at all. You can get that smooth gameplay and it's gonna feel like you're gaming directly on the device. Now, there's a ton of performance and power in this chipset and I can't wait to see what OEMs actually do with this. So your favorite devices and your favorite gaming smartphones, you're gonna see a lot of performance increases this year with the Snapdragon 8 chipset. Oh, and let's not forget, if you have a game that utilizes Vulkan, you're going to see a 65% performance increase. Honestly, that is amazing, which means, look, the games we're going to be playing uh, with this chipset, we're going to see just better graphics, better performance uh, on it, we're going to see better efficiency overall, and we're going to get something that as gamers we will enjoy. So I am really excited to see what kind of uh, um, you know games we get to play with the Snapdragon 8, what kind of devices we're going to get with this, and honestly, this is going to be totally awesome. Okay guys, let me know what games you want to see on the Snapdragon 8 uh, chipset. Of course, once devices hit, I'm going to be playing those games for you so we can check it out, but Honestly, I am truly excited to see what this chip has to offer and what developers and gamers will use to take advantage of it in the best ways. So if you have any questions or any comments, let me know. Otherwise, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and always enjoy your entertainment.